I'm sorry, can you hang on a sec? Gotta close this window. Melania's out there blowing bubbles for Eric. Tremendous! Amazing! <laughs> Dad, I got one in my mouth! It tastes like soap! Your main job here is to go in rooms before me to make sure there's no static electricity. Place. I think we're gonna enjoy the Beltway lifestyle. Washington, D.C. is a wonderful city to call home. Don't go in there, it's not safe. Well done, Peter. I think this sucks. I want to go back to Quahog. Tomorrow at James Woods High, it's scoliosis spine check day. It's the one day a year I get touched. Meg, your father got this great new opportunity and we need to support him. Let's give DC a chance, huh? This is the most strangest place ever. Yee! Ha! Oh, this ain't so different. Yeah, Meg, trust me. Before long, we'll fit right in here, like a cowboy in a Chinese Starbucks. We're happy you're here, Mrs. Griffin, Mr. Griffin, and we're glad you brought your two children and former governor, Chris Christie. Oh, sweetie, I'm sorry everyone thinks you're a historically unpopular fatso from New Jersey. Folks, to drink this evening, we've got red wine, white wine, and a fifth of bourbon. What'll you have, disgraced political oddity Roger Stone? I'll take the fifth. <laughs> that works on two levels. Layered. Holy girl boner. Ivanka Trump has a gentle breeze indoors. Sometimes I wish I could meet someone else whose dad is a fat idiot who once had a hit television show and who over time has worn out his welcome. Meg, I think you'd look amazing in my brand of lifestyle products that are designed to represent a poor person's idea of what a rich person would wear. You know, Meg's dad is all... Shut up, Tiffany. Yeah, shut up, Tiffany. Odes. Whoa, was that Meg? <laughs> Hang on, he's still getting ready. Products and your fraudulent university and... Oh my god! Oh please, every president since Washington has done this. My darling Bess, tonight I'm going to drop the big one onto your Pacific theater. Dearest Martha, I cannot wait to once again place my hand onto your gates of Venus. Hey, Barbara Bush, working late, sleeping in office, crazy headache, you look like my mom. Last night at the White House, President Trump touched me inappropriately. You expect us to believe that the President of the United States would grab a woman by her <laughs> That's ridiculous! Many people are saying it was the best press briefing in all of history. Mr. Griffin, you're not speaking to President Trump. That's a butternut squash. Mr. President, please. I'm not interested. You'll regret this. Oh my god! What would your third wife, the softcore girl-on-girl -girl porn lady, think about this? Or the actual porn star your lawyer paid hush money to? I quit! What? That's right. And you know what else? My days of being mean and insulting are over. You are cash poor. <laughs> Kill him in front of me and I sex you. So damn divided, America. Peter! Grab my hand! I can't! It's too little! Hey, call me if you ever need help moving. Trudeau, away! I am a proud hat owner. Shut up, Meg. From our family to yours, 
We're very frightened.